indeed, friends and neighbors, welcome down to Banjo Bonanza. We're so glad you could tune in with us today. Well, I've got some more, uh, some more surprises for you in terms of the banjo arrangement department, as well as some new tunes I've just worked up for the banjo that I haven't played on the Bonanza before. And as you can tell, we've, we've, got, uh, we've, we've got a new sign for the High Strong Hillbilly Hamsters made by Marlene. And we would like to uh, invite you, if, if you uh, are so inclined, to create your own sign for the High Strong Hillbilly Hamsters and we'll feature it on the show. And of course give you credit and the, the, I know that the Hamsters, Froggy Winnet Basin and Mr. Ryan Lander will, uh, <clears throat> will appreciate that. So without any further ado, our, uh, our opening act, the whole band is assembled. I heard them rehearsing. They're, they're trying to nail that one song really, really well and they're doing a great job. So friends, let's get off into the good times and fun right here with the High Strung Hillbilly Hamsters on Banjo Bonanza. We're so glad that you're joining us. Here we go. The High Strung Hillbilly Hamsters with Froggy Winnebasing and Mr. Ryan Lander on the jug. A any self respecting band got to have a good jug player. And uh, these guys did great. How about a round of applause? Yeah. Woo. Yes, indeed. Friends, go ahead and make a sign. And uh, you can send it to us via analog mail. And we'll, we'll put it up on the, on the show. And we always are evolving here at the Ponderosa. Thanks, guys. Fantastic job to all of you. Now go ahead and have another, another snort. Have, have one for me, too. Have, Ryan Lander, you can have one for Ryan Polzak. Woo! <laughs> all right, we're going to bring these guys over here. All right, I'm going to pull out the old five string now. now. I love this five string. It, it was made by Larry Cohey for me. And it's the, uh, it's, it's, it's the only really high-quality banjo I own. I own a lot of guitars, but I've never... Never come across a banjo that spoke to me this much, and I'm very grateful to be playing on it. I think, la yeah, last week I showed you guys a picture of when I was 20 and uh, with Larry after he assembled the banjo, which was pretty cool. All right, you guys. I hope the weekend was good. Weekend was good here. We uh, we uh, had a had a good date night on Saturday and made the uh, made the high Marlene made the high strung hillbilly hamsters in a uh, fit of uh, of creativity, and I had a chance to work up a couple of new arrangements, like I was saying. And friends, I was so glad that we could be here together again. This is great. This is so great. Oh yeah, that's for uh, Surf Banjo coming up. <laughs> I'm so glad you guys enjoyed that. One of my favorites to start any show with the Flint Hill Special. Here we go. Thank you. 
All righty, friends, that's a good old tune called Sally Ann. And I was listening to a guy named Enoch Rutherford. E-N-O-C-H, Rutherford. Check him out. Uh, killer clawhammer player. And uh, I was just listening to his arrangement of that. And there's some, there's some great footage, too, that, that he does. And I just felt compelled to do it. So uh, that's, that's, that's my arrangement of Sally Ann. Which is which is which is a great old song right there. Alrighty, heck yeah, friends. <laughs> is Truck Driving Songs Part 2, or Truck Driving Songs The Extended Trailer, or Extended Cab, however you'd like to do it. I was just talking with my buddy Sim Chessie right before while we were communicating via text, and I told him about that. So I'd like to do the Truck Driving National Anthem on banjo to let you know that we got trucking songs coming up this Friday, and uh, more 8-track display as well, which I will post throughout the week. Here we go with some Truck Driving Man. Key G if you're playing along. When I stopped at a roadhouse in Texas, was a little place called Hamburger Dance. Oh, <laughs> 
and Tom. So pour me another cup of coffee. For it is the best in the land. I'll sing along with me. steel tone in there. Well, here's one about, <clears throat> well, other than the uh, nicotine, which I've never really been a fan of. This one's called Caffeine, Nicotine, and Benzedrine. I was a big fan of caffeine and Benzedrine when I was in my early 20s. Now I just like caffeine in the form of tea. So we all got to get that out of our systems. Of course, we got to put it into our systems before we get it out, but I don't recommend it. But, uh, you know, when you're doing a lot of, of time on the road or a lot of gigs back to back, it seems like a good idea, especially when you're like 24 and, and you feel invincible. So, friends, here's a, here's a good one that I'd like to play for you on banjo that I have not done on banjo yet for the show. I love it. I've been pushing that deep so since early dawn. I ain't had no sleep, boys. Don't know how long. And hold on to so much fun, with which I'm going to do some more of this set, this show, and because i got two new, uh, two new arrangements that I did not have last week, which I'm super excited to share with you, and I'll get into that a little bit, a little bit later on down here as uh, folks get off work and, you know, tune in, and if you're getting off work, that's so awesome that you're working, we're happy for you. All right, we are in tune right now. That's a pretty good thing. Yeah. Feed me a cornbread and beans, Lord, Lord, they feed me a cornbread. 
to this great hangout we got going on here. We got Mary Wheeler is here. Mary, thank you for your incredible support of both these shows. You're literally, like, like, like we were exchanging in our emails, helping keep the lights on. Dominique is here. You're also helping keep the lights on, Dominique. I'm glad you're doing some camping and getting some good times in. We got Beth Emerson and Jason, big fans of the surf banjo. We're so glad you guys are becoming regulars. I can't wait to show you the new arrangements. Tracy, Chris, yes. Howdy, Chris. <laughs> I'm glad you guys are here. Madeline Christopher's here. Frank Companion is here. Yes, Steve Kittle. Well, all right, Steve. Mr. Bob Powell. Sarah Travis. Yes, Michael D. Martinez. Michael, thanks for dropping by, man. I'm so glad that you're uh, 
You're, you're supporting a wide range of, of working musicians, man. My hat's off to you for that. Mr. Jack Weldon is here. Ah, oh, Marty and Helena, right on. And LaVey Smith is here. Fantastic, fantastic musician, friends. If you don't know who LaVey Smith is, definitely look her up and, uh, and listen to her tunes. She is a Bay Area treasure and absolutely awesome. And of course, Perfect Attendance Award, Sarah Polzak and Ryan Polzak, from up there in northern Wisconsin. And we got Lee Marie all the way from Australia. Thanks for tuning in. Halfway around the world, completely different season. I don't, I don't know what time it is over there, but I'm sure it's not 728 specific standard time there. And Susie Woodrum, the lawn and the Sues, yes. And Mr. Pork U Pine, the Snorkel. I'm glad you're here, man. And we, we got Steve Cordes here, Mr. Mark Marsan is here, Mr. Roy Wilson, Brian Cisco, yeah, Brian. Uh, Led Lopez, all right, from Argentina. Bienvenidos, welcome. Brendan, all right, ladies and gentlemen. The original bass player of the Royal Deuces, Mr. Brendan Gleck is tuning in. Hey, Bernie. Oh, man, Mr. Burn Darn himself, ladies and gentlemen. And Nick is here. Hey, Nick, Brendan's here. How about that? Oh, man. Oh, well, I got to do one that uh, Brendan and I used to do all, all together before I changed key here. Brendan, let's do the crawdad hole, man. This is one of the earliest ones, I think, that you and I did together for sure. And it's also a good sing-along. And if Desmond wants to sing along with this too, uh, uh, go, go ahead, man. Uh, big hugs to Mandy as well. Brennan, thanks for tuning in, man. All right. I just want to take time to welcome everybody to the show. And I'm going to do the song that Brendan and I used to do together right now, one called Crawdad Hole. And if you know it, sing along, play along. Roy, I'm going to pass the guitar solo to you on this one. And uh, go ahead and take that. Key of G, Roy, here we go. <laughs> Hey! 
that I wrote. It's Old Birch time, friends. And also, it's 735, which, which means we're, we're going to do that group share that we've been doing. It's a new tradition we're starting. So everybody go ahead and find that share button. Uh, it's usually on the lower left-hand side. Go ahead and get the mouse over it or your finger over it or whatever you need to do. And we're going to do a simultaneous banjo bonanza show share. Share the show, boys. In three, two, one, bingo! Share the show. That way if somebody needs some banjo in their life, they've got it. So thanks for sharing the show, friends, and thanks for supporting the show. Here's one that uh, I composed, and I'm so happy to play it for you right now. It's a number called Old Birch. Let me get some Old Birch setting on here. All right. <laughs>
I love that song. Restoring a 53 Elden Outboard. That, oh, Ryan, I know that smell, man. Oh, I need that in my life right now. That smell of Wisconsin Lake. And just all the things that go along with that. Right on, friends. I'm so glad you enjoyed that one. That's a, that's a song called Old Birch that I absolutely love playing for you. All right, I'm going to go ahead and go to a different key. And then... We're gonna do some surf. Whoops! We're gonna do some surf banjo because it was so popular last time that, that it's gonna be a new thing on these shows because nobody else is doing this. Uh, and I thank you for that. Hey, Jason Stearman's tuning in. Jason, Jason, ladies and gentlemen, is a long haul truck driver, keeping the infrastructure of this country going. And I so appreciate that wherever you are, you spread the word. And, and Jason, uh, this Friday is gonna be truck driving episode part two. The uh, extended cab version. So I'll be pulling up a, a lot of the uh, a lot of the classics that were enjoyed on the episode one, as well as some new tunes this Friday on the truck driving episode on the Polzac Ponderosa. Yeah, woo! <laughs> Alrighty, friends, if you're enjoying the show, and you can, go ahead and uh, go ahead and, and, and wire us some financial enthusiasm if 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 you are at all able. Uh, certainly not. Uh, you know, it's whatever you can do. You know, that's what's so cool is uh, if we don't look out for each other, who will? But by investing in this show, you're keeping bananas, Banjo Bonanza going as well as the Ponderosa going. And you are supporting professional musicians, professional artists, which uh, is so cool, friends. Every little bit goes literally to keep the lights on and to further reinvest in equipment in the show and time spent learning materials we don't have to you know sacrifice quality at all and we've already done the share the show but you can always share it again and we'll do another group share but we so appreciate friends the fact that you have literally put the gas in the engine that's taken us on this long haul journey of live music streamed into your homes it's a privilege and an honor to be with you wherever you are whether whether you're, you're watching this at home whether you're on the road whether you're camping it's just, it's just so awesome to be there. So I, I cheers you, friends. Let's see, the glass for today, check this bad boy out. This is like 70s gilded goodness, or maybe even 60s. Right, there we go. I'm going to see it better there. Oh, yeah. You just, you just don't find this stuff at cost plus, you know. <laughs> you find this at garage sales and old neighborhoods, which is where I got this one. I used to drink tequila out of this when I was in a tequila phase in my late 20s. Ah, now, soda water. <laughs> For the show, anyways. Beer after. All right, I'm going to go ahead and move it up to the key of A. And then it's time to get songs in A, and then I'm going to do some surf banjo. Just because, uh, let's see, we're at 742. I'm anticipating bag fries, you guys. Uh, I just am. Oh, part of our great weekend, uh, I barbecued some killer chicken and made some french fries for Marlene and I, and you guys saw it. We, we had bag fries! It was awesome! I thought of everybody on the show, and uh, that's why we wanted to share that. Marlene and I were just singing you, you guys' praises and, uh, and, and our gratitude for, al for literally allowing the show to continue and making it happen. All right, I love... Brendan, I love that you're tuning in, man. Brandon, if there's anything that you want to hear, let me let uh, Marlene know uh, via the, the the typing, and if I know it, I'll do it for you, man. Man, Brandon, Brandon, like the friend I started the Royal Deuces with in 1999. Brandon, I'm grateful for that, man. That was awesome. All right, Larry and Laura from up in Quincy are watching too. Hey, Larry. Hi, Laura. Glad you guys are here. Hey, Liz. Right on. All right, time for a couple numbers in A, then it's surf banjo time.
Suicide Awareness Prevention Program for Veterans, and I respect that a lot. So, thank you for doing that, Trent. You're a, you're a hell of a solid human being, and uh, we appreciate your service. We also appreciate your promotion of awareness of things that need to be made aware of and uh, things that folks are going through. So, please welcome Trent Tano, ladies and gentlemen, as well as a celebrated published author here in San Francisco. He is a, a, a man of, of great depth and a veteran, and just one solid human being. I've known him since 1999. So Trent, I'm glad you're here, man. Thanks for, thanks for being on board. Oh, okay, let's see what's on the list here. All right, hey, Ronnie's here. All right, Ronnie, Banjo in the Hollow. I've been looking that up and been uh, working it out. I don't have it quite to the point where I would want to uh, play it yet because I really want to nail it but uh, thanks for uh, putting that one on my radar I know that uh, you've requested that in the past and uh, I didn't know it so it's been cool to listen to it and, and start to come up with arrangements so I'm glad you're here man I can't wait to make music with you at some point that's gonna be that's gonna be fantastic yeah all right Ronnie so check it out let's see here let's do Let's do this version of Shady Grove. This is in a major key with a different chord progression. It's not, it's, uh, it's pretty happy. I learned from my friend Annie Staninitz. <laughs> Shady Grove, she was standing in the door. 
I'm excited to do this with you. And I'll start out with uh, one of my brand new arrangements. And, and this, this happens because you guys are supporting the show. You're sharing it, you're sending financial enthusiasm, you're tuning in, you're telling your friends, you're, you're saying hi to each other. Gosh, I love it. I love it, it gives, gives both Marlene and I so much, so much inspiration. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for our producer, our director, Minxpiration, and one of the most amazing human beings I've ever met in my life, the love of my life. Ladies and gentlemen, round of applause for Marlene right here. Just doing so much on the hillbilly NASA side of the, of the computers, getting things set up. There's cables, there's cords, there's plugs, there's things that's like three letters like USB and KGB and and, and F-U-C-K, I, I don't know, you know, like things that just go, you know, plug me, plug in there. And she knows how to do all that. Thanks, honey. And she looks good doing it, too. Wearing a really pretty red dress today and her hair's all done up. Went out and got your hair did, honey. It looks good. Actually, she just did it right here. <laughs> so we can't go out and get our hair did. That's why I'm, I'm hey, Nick, I'm working on my uh, Kurt Russell 80s, 80s man hair right now. <laughs> Maybe one of these days I'll 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 I'll, I'll get the feather and, and really just you know do a banjo bonanza a la Kurt Russell. <laughs> All right. Hey Roy, you're gonna dig this one, man. Here's a Dwayne Eddy tune that uh, it's Bill Justice tune actually, um, and Dwayne Eddy covered it. It's a pretty cool number, and I love working this up, friends. It's a number for the first time, as far as I know. Please, if anybody knows of any of these elf, other songs on banjo, I gotta know. But I, I think we seriously are getting into new territory here, which is really exciting that this is happening. And I will do my best to, to play these tunes just out of respect for the tune, out of respect for the banjo. I don't wanna play at it, I just wanna do it. As Nick and I's dad would say, do it right. So I try to get these arrangements as right as I can. Oh yeah. Thank you. 
guys think? That is a brand new arrangement that, uh, I, actually I just came up with that arrangement last night before the show. Woo! <laughs> Cheers to your friends. I love that you guys are rolling with Surf Banjo. Let us know in the comments if you would uh, purchase a Surf Banjo EP. Because if so, I'll record it um, with Marlene right here in the living room. Or actually right here in the Ponderosa to get that Ponderosa sound to it. And I'll play all the instruments. I don't know what I'll do about the drum solos, but I'll figure that out. Oh, yeah. Friends, we're officially in bag fry time. And we're, we're right in the middle of the wave, so we're going to ride this wave. 
since we're doing surf banjo and we're all a part of something new here, let's do another group share. What do you say? Let's 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 let other folks know that this is happening. So go ahead and go ahead and find the the share button. Hold the mouse over it. We're gonna do it in three, in two, in one. Whoa! Surf up and share the show, ladies and gentlemen. Playing some surf banjo for you. Surf banjo right here on the Volzac Ponderosa. Oh yeah! <laughs> oh. Woo! Oh yeah! Sounds pretty good, doesn't it? Okay, let's let's see what else we got here on the surf banjo. Let me look at my surf banjo list here. Oh yeah! Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Oh man, uh, Nick and Liz and August, Serena, uh, Marlene, and I watched the uh, dedication to Uncle Pete last night. Beer Hunter. <laughs> oh, that was great. Okay, so here's one that uh, I recorded with Hank Maniger and Les James on the Risque Riot Vintage Compact Disc. It's the only known guitar arrangement of a saxophone song. And I said, well, hell, it's the only, hell, it was the only uh, guitar rendition. Why don't I do a banjo rendition too? And just like, and I was like the dot com, dot net, dot org, just get all the dots after that so uh, I can, you know, do this with Comanche. I got, uh, I got pretty fired up doing this. <laughs> tune than it already is. Sometimes surf banjo hard on those strings. There we go. Yeah. All right. Thank you. 
cool to do some miserloo for you there, friends. On banjo, yes. This is just getting tighter and tighter. Uh, last week was about as, as loose as those arrangements would be. Hey, Andrew Carrier is here. All right, Andrew. Ladies and gentlemen, Cajun accordion legend and singer, Mr. Andrew Carrier is here. He's tuning in. Andrew, I'll, I'll, after I do some surf banjo, I'll do a Cajun song on the banjo. Uh, I know I do uh, Amade two-step a lot, but maybe there's something else I can I can pick up, pick that that you and I do together as well. Make please make Andrew welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Andrew's a great guy, 82 years young, and I'm on the Andrew Carrier exercise program. I just call them mix exercises, and uh, keep uh, keep keep the blood going. So, Andrew, welcome, man. I'm glad you're here. Okay, let's do let's let's do some uh, Malaganya on banjo, shall we? Since I'm in the same key here. Friends, I'm so glad you guys are digging some surf banjo. Let let everybody know that this is happening, and uh, also that uh, we, if if there's enough demand, we'll make an EP. Let us know. Here we go, Nick. I know that you were digging this one last time. I'm so glad that the Nick Polzaks are, are are tuning in. Ah oh, man, I love you guys very very much. Thank you. 
just to kind of explore some ideas and uh, to see what, what fires you up. Because guess what, friends? We're all involved in something new here. Whoa, that's awesome. And I just noticed that my Aunt Susan tuned in. Hi, Aunt Susan. Lots of love to you, Aunt Susan. Thanks for tuning in. Aunt Susan, you're hearing for the very first time ever, to the best of most of our knowledge here, is the Adventures into Surf Banjo. And uh, I'm glad you're getting to getting to hear that. Oh man, my aunt Susan, Susan Eggers, ladies and gentlemen, is is here, and uh, I would say please make her welcome because she's a wonderful, wonderful lady, and uh, she's tuning in too. That's awesome, Aunt Susan. Sending you lots of love. I just uh, I just watched Greg and Helen's uh, uh, Marlene and I watched Greg and Helen's uh, 70th birthday to Uncle Pete, and it was good to see your face on there. That was it. Just made me smile just to see you because I miss you. Oh, thank you. All righty, friends. Um, I'm going to do uh, one more surf banjo tune. And then uh, our friend Nanook is here from New Zealand. And she would like to hear Old Joe Clark, which I never get tired of playing. And uh, if you got any other requests that I might know, we're in bag fry time. So I'll go ahead and do that. I put some metronome work into this one. I'm still refining, let's see how it goes. <laughs> Thank you. 
you showed me. And you're a very special human being, Bill. I respect you personally and professionally. Friends, look up Bill Evans, not the piano player, although he does have a great album called Bill Evans Plays Banjo. Bill, this is a musical adventure I thought I'd try, man. The surf banjo. I'm still playing on Larry's banjo that he made me. I'm so happy to see you, man. Lots of love to you and the family. Alright, Bill, let's see what you do. Pipeline one more time. Here we go. surf banjo. I think I think he would have loved that. So, friends, that, that's the surf banjo set right there. Man, how cool is that? I'm digging it. And uh, this is, I'm still working on these arrangements to get them even tighter. But now that I know that you guys are enjoying it so much, I'm going to refine the heck out of these and get them dialed in. And uh, I just love that Bill Evans is here. Bill, all right, man. Woo, Bill, you're a heck of a banjo player. I'm so stoked you're here. Right, I'm gonna turn down some of the uh, some of the uh, some of the hoo boy surf tone right there, and let, 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 let's see what let's see what else we can get into. And all right, Bill, if there's anything that uh, I can pick for you, I mean I know you've heard it all, but uh, let me know, man, because I would I would it would be my honor to pick something for you, uh, just because of how much you showed me on the banjo. All right, friends, let's let's go ahead and see now now Nuke. Tuning in all the way from New Zealand, requested Old Joe Clark. So, Nanook, I'll be happy to do that for you. Friends, if you are uh, enjoying this adventure of surf banjo and the banjo bonanza, I'm just going to make a, uh, another announcement here. We do have ways to express financial enthusiasm. Being as if uh, Marlene and I are both professional artists, this is what we are literally counting and depending on to... Uh, to make sure that we can still keep the lights on, still have beer and food. Yes, I said beer first on purpose. Beer and food in the fridge. And uh, also it allows me to, you know, put in the time to really go ahead and do this. And, uh, you know, right now, you know, th this is a Team Eminem production. We got Team Eminem. <laughs> Team Eminem, do, 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 do. That's Marlene. She's amazing, friends. She's beautiful inside and out too. And uh, so, Right here, this, this is a good way to do that. And if you'd like to do analog financial enthusiasm, otherwise known as a check, uh, direct message me, and I'll tell you where to send it. And that would uh, be much appreciated, friends. You know, we, we don't need much. We're pretty frugal around here. Just enough to, you know, just tide us through until this whole thing gets over and we can get back to the stages and the concert halls again. All righty. So, Nanook. All right, Nanook, I'm so stoked you're here. Oh man, you know what friends, when this is all over, like we talked about, we're going to have a, if, if we all can, like a Ponderosa in-person get-together with, with, with anybody who can make it. We'll just make it like a weekend thing and 
we can see each other in person and just just have good times. <laughs> I know priorities, PBR, and oh yeah, see there we go. You see, Marlene and I love our loggers and pilsners. Okay, so here, Nanook, let's go ahead and do old Joe Clark for you. Thanks for tuning in, Nanook. Woo. All right, that, that little surf banjo expedition there. breakdown and then I'll see if I can do a Cajun tune for Andrew. All right, here we go. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, Ryan. Oh, man, I love picking that one for you. Well, let's, let's, let's slow it down again and do some rain and snow, which is always one of my favorites to play on the show here. Now, Nuke, thanks for requesting that song of old Joe Clark. I love it. Shower today, I said, man, I got warm, clean running water, and all I have to do is turn on a faucet. Simple pleasures, friends, they're just, they always are good.
Thank you very much, friends. I just love, love, love that too. That's, a, that's a, my arrangement of rain and snow with some bright sunny south in there too, friends. That's always a fun one to pick. And a Jason Williams, Big Mama's Door on a banjo. Hmm. I hadn't thought about that. Let me see. Hell, we're in bag fry time. Bag fry time, anything can happen in bag fry time. You know, this is, this is interesting because it's a recorded live performance. So, yeah, I, I try things, but at the same time it's recorded. So, you know, that's what's fun about this. Let me see if I can get this to work. Mama's door on banjo. Honey, should we give it a whirl? All right, two thumbs up from Marlene, ladies and gentlemen, the love of my life, as well as our producer, our director, and chief captain of Hillbilly NASA, running all the things that have abbreviations and cables that uh, go to all kinds of places and plug into all kinds of different computers. It's amazing, friends. Hillbilly now. I'm just charged the audio, you know. I let I let Marlene make sure that the picture is this good. And a big thanks to our, our our big sponsors who have allowed this to happen. Mr. Bob Powell for helping us invest in the camera, Dr. Peter Sherris, John McKenzie, Neil Lavinius, uh, Tracy and Chris, uh, and uh, um, for the guitar, Mr. Ben Cole of Diodario. Uh, those N NYXLs are I don't have the guitars here now, but let's keep the keep the guitars going. And friends, everybody else who contributes. Two, it, it all makes a difference, and it, it just makes sure that this is here. So thank you. All right, so I'm going to give this a whirl. Friends, you're about to see, of course, this is something I normally do anyways, make up something on the spot. So here's, here's, uh, here's my arrangement on the spot of uh, Big Mama's Door by request from Mr. Jason Williams out there in Colorado. <laughs>
how beautiful her smile is, friends. Wow. All right. Jason, thanks for the request, man. That was really a, a, a trip to be able to try that live. Mm -hmm. That was a hell of a lot of fun. All right, friends. Gosh, this is awesome. I'll tell you what, we'll truck on to 9 o'clock because I'm having so much fun with you, both of us. Team Eminem. Team Eminem. Do, 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 do. Are having so much fun with you, friends. Each and every one of you. And I'd, I'd like to let you know that uh, we've got truck driving episode extended cab version uh, two this Friday on live from the Polzac Ponderosa. Then the following Friday, uh, my buddy, uh, Grammy Award winning violinist Mads Tolling will be joining me. We are from two opposite ends of the spectrum, but we find such cool common ground. It's so unique that. Each of us wanted to bring that to you. So that's going to be a special episode. Uh, he's also a professional musician who's kind of like looking around going, where the heck can I work right now? So uh, we're going to bring him on here to the Jerk Free Zone. This is Ponderosa. Oh, great news. Speaking of Jerk Free Zone, the t-shirts have arrived to the printers. They finally got them. It, it's taking longer than expected because of shipping. I don't, I don't know. But they arrived. They're being printed. So those who paid in advance... I cannot wait to be sending those out to you. I just wanted to give you an update that we haven't forgotten. We're just waiting on the, uh, now the printer's got them. They're, they're printing them away. So all of you put in your orders for Jerk Free Zone shirts. Thank you. Marlene designed those. And uh, it, uh, it goes to put that out there.
and turning every day. But the wine won't take effect the way it used to. And I'm hurting in an old familiar way. Tonight the bottle will let me down. So uh, I'm going to send that one out to you for sending that our way. We appreciate that. That's some Merle Haggard banjo style, friends. Good music is good music. I just like to see what I can make work on the banjo. All right, friends, we might be coming in for a landing here. Jason Steerman says go to 930. Uh, Jason, this banjo weighs about 30 pounds. So uh, tell you what, friends, uh, we're going to be resuming. We're going to do one more. Unless like, there's an avalanche of financial enthusiasm right now. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll go ahead and do one more so we can take us in for a landing. And then we've got trucking episode number two, extended cab. Uh, or Ken, let me tell you, how about we do this? The Kenworth Aerodyne sleeper cab version. I love the Kenworth Aerodyne sleeper cab look. It looks absolutely awesome. This looks like a, a, a 69 Olds Vista Cruiser as well. I wonder if Oldsmobile got that from Kenworth or Kenworth got that from Oldsmobile. Either way, check out the Vista Cruiser and the Kenworth Aerodyne Sleeper Cab, and you'll be like, whoa. Bob's probably putting pictures up there already. Oh, Bob, we love you, man. Tracy, we love you. Oh, you guys are the best. All right. So let me go ahead and uh, let me see what we can bring it in with. Honey, any requests to, to, to bring it in with? All right. Uh, the open book right now. Sweet. Oh, uh, we had a request for Orange Blossom Special. Let me see if, um, you know what? I've, I've worked that out on guitar, uh, Mike. So tell you what, I will do that on, um, on Friday. I, I could do it now on banjo, but it'd be just a bunch of rolls over chords. And I got fired from my first bluegrass band for doing that. So it's something that I swore I would never do again unless I absolutely had to, just rolls over chords. I want to be able to nail the actual melody. So, but I'd also only been playing banjo for like three years at that point. So, you know, it was, it was a good slice of humble pie. And I still, that's why I love working on the surf banjo, to really get that melody in there. So, um, but I really appreciate the request, Mike. And uh, I'll, Marlene and I will put it on for uh, Friday's trucking show, the Aerodyne Sleeper Cab episode. <laughs> Friends, thank you so much. Let's see, I'm going to bring it in with here. I'm going to take it home with Charlie Horse Stop. I know Tracy really likes this one. And uh, I can't wait to pick this with you and Chris. This would be awesome. Friends, we love you. Keep the shiny side up and the greasy side down. Remember at some point something's bound to go right. That this is, this is just making us closer. Even though, like the house bound and down says, we're isolated, but we're not alone. 
Okay, friends, I'm going to take you on out of here with the Charlie Horse Stop by the great Jim Mills, one of my favorite banjo players. Ah, I can't, I miss you guys already. But we'll see each other on Friday. So here we go, friends, with the Charlie Horse Stop. <laughs> Wishing you a great night. Have an excellent week. Be positive as best you can. And we're going to put the hammer down this Friday for Truck and Song, Episode Part 2, the Aerodyne Sleeper Cab Edition. We will see you all very, very soon. Thank you for your support, your enthusiasm, and your efforts to make this a jerk-free zone. We love you, and good night from the Polzac Ponderosa. <laughs>